From the search deep in the sea to the depths of emotion, from the families of the missing, ABC's Bob Woodruff was there in Kuala Lumpur as the anguish erupted into anger. A mother's anguished cries today, raw proof of families at their breaking point. Where's my son, she wails. Why won't your government give me an answer? Today, she joined 20 family members of Flight 370 passengers protesting at the daily Malaysian government news conference, accusing officials of lying to them. They're doing nothing, this woman screams. The Malaysian government is doing nothing. The scene descending into bedlam as the families were dragged out of sight. That mother screaming one word, why? Malaysian officials later defending what's been a confusing investigation, riddled with contradictions. Uh, we are trying our very best. And it, and it is, and it, and it is heart-wrenching, uh, even for me. But the brother of American passenger Philip Wood today telling us he's very frustrated that the Malaysians are making a civil issue about people and turning it into a military secrets issue. Philip Wood worked in Malaysia, his desk now covered with hundreds of colorful origami cranes, a message from his co-workers, they are still not giving up hope. Now, of course, the families here in Kuala Lumpur feel exactly the same way, Diane. They are begging the world to not forget their children and also pressuring the government to get them home as fast as they can.